Good morning children welcome back we are continuing the chapter water a precious natural resource in this chapter we have already discussed some introductory part but now we are coming to there are two important categories of natural resources renewable and non renewable you know what are renewable resources renewable resources are resources which uh, cannot be run out or which cannot be uh, you know completed or finished and if we use them and what we say and those can be replaced and this natural resources can be replaced by natural process okay so renewable resources are resources which cannot be exhausted or finished up or which cannot be cannot run out and also can be produced through natural methods sunlight is an example plants and animals are renewable resources you know that there are non renewable resources are resources which can be exhausted or cannot be renewed even if we use very sparingly even if we use very sparingly or very limited manner they will be exhausted or finished up anyhow for example fossil fuels such as coal petroleum natural gas etc anyhow this this natural resources can be categorized in detail as i told you renewable the word renewable means which we can renew or regenerate or reform there can be two categories of renewable resources exhaust inexhaustible and exhaustible inexhaustible natural resources cannot be finished up they can be renewed or regenerated by natural methods they will be there in the nature forever sunlight sunlight it is said that five sunlight will be available in the earth in the next 5 billions of years so it will be inexhaustible air as long as plants and animals are here we can see air will be there in the most various gaseous components like oxygen nitrogen carbon dioxide etc will be there in the air water is also a uh, inexhaustible natural resource whereas exhaustible uh, natural resource renewable resource can also be exhaustible if you use them carelessly beyond our needs the soil forest ground water etc will be exhausted or finished up so the new resources can be inexhaustible like sunlight air water and the new resources can also be exhaustible or finishable if you use them carelessly beyond or more than our uh, requirement okay then you can see soil forest and ground water will be depleted or reduced hence we can say renewable resource can be inexhaustible and exhaustible there are no renewable resources uh will be resources which can be finished up any how we use them sparing for example uh we know uh, we have non renewable resources like minerals metals like gold aluminum copper iron all this can be recycled and we can reuse okay that is only but otherwise they cannot be renewed in the nature by natural process they cannot be renewed by natural but they can be recycled for example aluminum cans metal cans like iron copper all this can be melted after using you know the waste material can be melted and we can reproduce it now those non renewable resources that cannot be recycled there are non renewable resources that cannot be recycled for example top soil we cannot make it out it will be naturally formed the fossil fuels like the coal petroleum natural gas all this will be uh, cannot be recycled so the non renewable resources can be recycled like mineral and cannot be recycled like top soil fossil fuels 